Ah, uh, the old brain recuperation break. You have saved me yet again. <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome back. Now, I just popped into this game. I looked at this for about 10 seconds. I actually went back and looked at some of these uh, other solutions, and I just sort of realized uh, this is probably just meant to be combined as a single puzzle. I was taking for granted that the, uh, the break over here was, like, significant. Like, that was the only time you could combine them. But that is apparently not the case. And uh, that was probably pretty obvious to the viewers watching. You were probably screaming at me and all that good stuff. Uh, all I can say to that, guys, I swear to you that it's different for the person doing the recording. <laughs> I understand that it's sometimes really frustrating when you get something and you think it's obvious and I'm not getting it. I don't do that to piss anybody off. <laughs> it's just the kind of thing that, uh, yeah, it's, it's different for the person playing the game and doing the recording. I, I swear to you. So this one here, this is a, a little bit of a monkey wrench. We've got a four blocker here, and this one... Okay, so it's probably just like this, right? It's interesting to note that I couldn't solve that one by coming out to this corner. Because, I guess because this square here would technically be included in that, so, okay. This guy. Okay. A four blocker with a two blocker over here. Can they overlap? Like so? No. Doesn't like either of those. Are they just included in each other? Really? That's worrisome. Ah. <laughs> uh, ah. Uh. Okay, what is this trying to teach me? If they're right next to each other. Oh, God. We already tried this, right? Yeah. Um, hmm. Is it significant if we just go the other way with it? No. What if we do this? Okay. There's only so many solutions on this board <laughs> if I try everything. Eventually, we'll get it. That's not the way I want to solve these, though. Of course, something like this on, like, a tutorial puzzle, it wouldn't be the worst thing ever if you brute-forced it. Because you can always go back and try and... try to learn the logic that it was trying to show you. Man, I can't even get the fucking four-blocker to be satisfied on this one. Wow, what the hell is this about? One, two, three, four. I wonder, the fact that they're next to each other, does that... Do you, like, subtract a square somehow? <laughs> no. <laughs> Do that. And then come up there. And here we have another prime example of how you come back in, a concept instantly clicks for you, and then a minute later you just crash right into another brick wall. It's freaking inevitable, guys. It is inevitable. I'm just gonna start doing crazy random shit. <laughs> What the fuck? Literally, what the fuck? Okay. This... Uh, 
Should I wish it? Can I? Well, let me try this again. I want to try. That's also acceptable. So these have the same solution, even though it's in a different thing. Okay, I have no idea how to word what I'm thinking here, but I'm thinking that if there's two of these blocks next to each other, or in not even next to each other, but two different types of shapes, and you can contain them in a thing that they could be logically combined into, then that'll that's acceptable. Oh no. The thing that was significant to me is if you try and solve this one like this, the blue one, or <laughs> the blue one, uh, the, the twofer right there is satisfied, but the four one is not. However, if you draw a four square, neither of them are satisfied. And that, that kind of breaks my brain. Uh, I, I, I don't know. I don't know, guys. <laughs> These Tetris puzzles, this is pretty rough. Okay, so if that logic follows, then on something like this, we could put the three at the bottom and the four up top. So that would go... Okay. Well, that seems to work on some level. I'm really terrified right now because that's the logic that I that I extracted from that solution, but I, I know damn well that it could very much be wrong. And now we have this. Okay, so we need to make a four and a two. If we do this, the two won't be included in the shape. So that's wrong. So in this scenario, should we try to do them separately? And is that even possible? I'm not convinced that it is. <laughs> if we do that... No, that's completely fucked. The shapes have to be in the area that you close off. So... If we do that, four is satisfied, two is not. I'm guessing this is... This is the kind of thing where we would not want to combine them. <laughs> but it's gonna be really hard. If we do that... Yeah. Okay, come on, come on. Think about this, think about this. That's how we would have to block off this one, but then we can't get back down to make the square. So if we do the square first... We can't even block it off that way. We would have to go like this, but then we can't come back around to get this one! Ah! Ah! It hurts. It hurts. I'm guessing they can share- that they're gonna have to share a border at some point. Damned if I know how, though. Yes, and we can't change the, the orientation of the blocks, right? Right. So we can't have... We can't draw in any of these squares right here, I don't think. I know this isn't the solution. <laughs> I'm just trying shit randomly. Oh! So they... 
Mm, so if they're connected, they don't have to be separated. Oh, even if they're not... That, well, okay, I guess that's kind of obvious looking back at this. Because we didn't separate them here either. That's just... Yeah. <laughs> it seemed like the kind of thing you would have to do each one independently. But if they're touching wherever the borders touch, that, that doesn't get filled in. I, I guarantee you guys going forward, I'm going to fuck that up millions of times. So, apologies right now. Okay. Here is a real challenge, I think. See, this is one of those deals where there's one right in the center. I don't know how the fuck to do that, because you can't block them off in the center. And I don't... These, it doesn't look like these are the kind that can be... The borders aren't touching. It's, it's three, three, and three. So, let's just see what happens if I do this. Right. So the trick to this one is going to be figuring out how the, the one in the middle works. Uh, maybe... Maybe we come the whole way over here. Oh, it, it doesn't... The, the symbol doesn't have to be centered. You can move it over and connect it to this one. Ah, ha, ha. I got it. What's happening? Oh my god, this whole thing's moving. It's taking me somewhere. Dude, am I stuck in here? How the hell do I get back? <laughs> help, help! I'm being kidnapped! By the mysterious puzzle island. Okay, I have so many questions right now. If I had solved this and then immediately run over and jumped back onto this platform, A, would I have had time to do that? And B, would that break the game? Because would I then be stuck over there, with no way to get over here? Why is there stairs leading down into this? Okay, well there's a wire coming from somewhere to this thing. Maybe this will drain the water eventually? Can't really see where the wire goes. Oh, is it is it connected to this? I think it is. Okay, over here we have a gate that is not passable. Oh, jeez. All right, we have to go up this way for now, guys. This is exciting. Finally figuring out these fucking Tetris blocks. It's like the it's like the last piece I needed to not be terrible at this game. <laughs> Disclaimer, I'm still terrible at the game. Alright, so this looks like if we solve this, we will get to open up uh, the shortcut. I think I was on the other side of this gate before I came over. Now. Um... This is four blocks long. It can be... I think, it, I think it has to be these four. We can't move the shape down because then this won't be included. So we're gonna do that. Then we're gonna do this. And then we're gonna do this. Ah, another one. This should be... 
Oh, this one's this is a smaller grid. Okay. Okay. That's fine. We're gonna start going up this way. And then No, no we're not. We have to end up here. Wait a minute, these are both two blocks. Okay, okay. We're gonna go like this. And down. And... Well, we have to cut out these two here, but then we have to come back to the exit too. My brain's missing some crucial piece of the puzzle here. What am I missing? What am I missing? Theoretically, I think this would solve it right here. But there's no way to get to the exit once you lock this off like that. Okay, I think I have the logic to this one. This is one of those ones where instead of rigidly adhering to where the pieces are on the board, you have to mentally rearrange them. And as long as they're all still included in the final shape, it doesn't matter. So the four blocker was over here on the left in my head. <laughs> uh, this Tetris piece here was right up top. And this one here got moved down to the bottom. And then once they're all arranged like that, you just block them out. And I'm pretty sure that's the logic on that one. That is... Ew, that's gonna fuck my brain so hard. I'm scared. I'm scared. Alright, so... This is how we escape, I guess. <laughs> uh, does this lead back to the boat? It does. Alright, I don't want to do that for now. I want to keep going through this area. Still pissed I haven't seen any recorders for a long time. 